Hello, I'm Luke Steiner, publisher of Atlantic City Weekly. We're here today at the Boys and Girls Club of Atlantic City, where the team from Caesars Entertainment is helping to refurbish the facility. Uh, my name is Michael Massari, and I'm the Senior Vice President for Caesars Entertainment. I run our meetings and conventions business across the country. And uh, we do a customer event. Uh, we've been doing it for 10 years in Las Vegas, and this is our first one in Atlantic City. And we're doing it here in Atlantic City because it's a great destination for meetings and events. And we are opening up a $126 million, 100,000 square foot meetings facility at Harris. That's going to be the largest meetings facility from Baltimore to Boston. And so we brought about 100 customers here to this weekend. And, and we did a big reception Thursday night at Harris. And we did some continuing education yesterday. And with this event, we always do a community service project. And so you ask your customers to come in and see the facilities and have a good time. And it's a little unusual that you ask them then to work for six hours, right? But we, t we do this community service because our customers love it. It's the right thing for us to do for, you know, just who we are and what we're about as a company and our culture. And it's also a great way to bring our customers into the fold. And they love it. So we have 120, 130 people, about 100 customers in our staff here at the Boys and Girls Club. And we spent the day, uh, you know, painting and cleaning and putting up some shelves and uh, reupholstering chairs and anything we could do to help out the Boys and Girls Club. It's really a pleasure for us. My name is John Smith. I'm the Senior VP and General Manager of Harrods Resort. We're here at the Boys and Girls Club of Atlantic City uh, helping out, cleaning up, painting, um, putting new fixtures up to help the kids after Sandy. Uh, we're here with not only our team members from executives down to front line, but we're here with our sales team some customers from Las Vegas and around the country to, to make a difference in the kids' lives. I'm actually on the board of directors here at the Boys and Girls Club, so I'm here frequently. And many of our facilities guys, our painters, our carpenters help out routinely. This time we have a group here from outside the country that are meeting planners and along with customers who come out and help us um, give back a little bit to the community here in uh, the Boys and Girls Club. Hi, my name is Michelle Musto and I work in the Resource Development Department of the Boys and Girls Club of Atlantic City and I am honored to be part of this day of service for, with Caesars Entertainment. Um, they came in here with a crew of people untiring effort. They've been painting and cleaning and organizing and making everything so beautiful for our kids. I'm so excited. A Monday afternoon after school when the kids come in and see how their club has been transformed. Um, I think the dedication and the kindness and the generosity from the volunteers and Caesars Entertainment Organization is just heartwarming and I feel very very lucky to be part of this day. Um, we have approximately 250 kids that come here Monday through Friday um, from 3 to 9. Um, they're aged from 5 to 17 years old. We have two facilities, one here at Penn Avenue, and our other facility is on Sovereign Avenue in Chelsea. 